We're here opening the Rink of Dreams, wonderful facility for the community of Arm Park, for the kids to enjoy and just have fun with it. So it's just a great thing for to bring the community together. Once we get past this foolishness of COVID, everybody will get back and have some fun. We're here to celebrate big plus for the town of Arpa and it's the official opening of this Rink of Dreams that uh, the town and the Optimist Club and Sullivan's and a dozen other huge uh, sponsors have worked on over the last 18 months or so and it's uh, become a reality. The biggest thing from my perspective is that it's going to continue traditions of the community coming together. When I was young, this was a playground up here on this spot and, uh, you know, we used to come here and then, you know, most of our activities in my day were, were outdoor and were free and were organized through uh, the local recreation department. It's so nice to get out into the small communities and be able to give back and see, uh, see the children in the area be able to have a great facility like this. This is one of the best facilities I've seen uh, in all the rinks that uh, the former Ottawa Centers Foundation, now the Ottawa Gatineau Youth Foundation has put out in this part of the province. It'll be a nice spot uh, for all these youths to be able to gather and come together and be able to take advantage of the outdoor facilities that they might not otherwise be able to have. I'm excited about the future and the opportunity that the youth of Iron Fire will have to participate in all kinds of activities uh, here at the rink. So I'm hoping it brings a community hub. Families and, and children can come here on a daily basis and have fun, play games, learn and grow up to be great citizens for this uh, community. The Sullivan Rink of Dreams is really, yeah, look at it, it's come together so well. Being in this pandemic that we are, um, having a facility like this in a smaller community is really going to provide opportunities for families to come out in a really safe way and get that physical activity that they need. And you know, getting physical activity really helps with your mental health. It's been a long few months. Um, and so to have this open up just before the holidays, can't wait to get some ice in here. Um, it's gonna be a facility that really, in the months to come, I think is gonna provide a lot of really um, great opportunities for people to just be outside and enjoying in a safe space physical wellness. We of course have Ms. Callie Robbins, it's grade 3 class from St. John the 23rd school here in Arnhem Park just across the street. What a great resource for these kids and you can see that this is really what it's going to be all about moving forward. 